I'm Nicole Bonk, head of flight testing at Skydio, and this is Skydio Flight School. Hey everyone, welcome back to Flight School. Today we're going to teach you how to get started with the controller. First thing you need to do is pair your controller with your Skydio 2. First, press the power button on your Skydio 2 for three seconds to turn it on. Then, open the controller arm, which automatically turns on the controller. Connect the controller to Skydio 2 using the provided USB-C cable. Wait until the LED light on your controller turns solid blue, then, you can disconnect the USB-C cable. You will only need to do this once, then they will connect automatically on future flights. Your controller will also check for updates whenever it connects to Skydio 2. The status of the controller is indicated by the LED light on the front. Here's a quick guide to the different statuses. Once you are ready to fly, you will need a mobile device with the Skydio 2 app. Open the controller arm and place your device in the holder. Connect your device to the controller using the provided USB-C cable and turn off the Wi-Fi on your mobile device. You can then launch Skydio 2 by pressing and holding the launch button on the controller or via the app. By default, your controller layout will be in mode two. You can change this as well as additional settings, such as controller sensitivity in the Skydio 2 app. Skydio 2 will maintain full obstacle avoidance while flying with the controller. Once you're ready to land, pilot Skydio 2 over a safe landing zone and press and hold the land button in the app or on the controller. And that's everything you need to know to get started flying with the controller. Your Skydio controller, what was it? I made all of that up. Hey everyone, welcome back to Flight School. Today we're gonna show you how to get started that's not it. Was that it? That was it? What time is it?